Welcome to the Caldwell Zoo. My name is Lauren and we are going to have some fun today. Follow me. The Caldwell Zoo is excited to participate in December. 31 days of STEM fun for the whole family. December was created by Girl Start and provides hands-on activities and videos like this one. You can participate by going to December.org. December 14th was National Monkey Day, so today we'll be highlighting some of our primate species here at the zoo. Currently, we have black and white calibus monkeys, cotton top tamarins, gold lion tamarins, ring-tailed lemurs, and the squirrel monkeys like the ones behind me. Let's go see if we can take a closer look. These little guys are squirrel monkeys. They are native to South America and live way high up in the canopy layer of the rainforest. Since they are up so high, they primarily eat any fruits, berries, flowers, and insects that they may find. Here at the Caldwell Zoo, we have 12 squirrel monkeys. Squirrel monkeys are very social animals. In the wild, they can live in troops of up to 40 to 50 individuals. Just like we talk, squirrel monkeys communicate by using a wide range of vocalizations. This little squirrel monkey seems to be sharing breakfast with our ducks. Since our little primates don't have any predators here at the zoo, we sometimes find them on the ground. Now let's go take a look at some of our tamarins. Here at the zoo we have two species of tamarins. We have cotton top tamarins and we have golden lion tamarins. Both species live way up high in the canopy just like our squirrel monkeys. I've asked the zookeeper to give our golden lion tamarins a treat today. Let's see if they like it. 
We filled this little box with mealworms and yummy goodies that our little monkeys love. They have to reach their arm inside of the box to get the treats out. This makes them work for their food rather than just placing it in a bowl for them. We call it enrichment. It gives the tamarins something new to do so they don't get bored. Sometimes we also give them peanut butter and grapes and all sorts of other good treats. Unfortunately, the golden lion tamarind is critically endangered. The rainforests in Brazil are disappearing because of logging, agriculture, and industry. Now we're in front of the ring-tailed lemur exhibit. Does anybody know where lemurs are from? They're from Madagascar. There are over 100 species and subspecies of lemurs in Madagascar, and our ringtails are one of the most common. Let's take a closer look at them. Ring-tailed lemurs spend a lot of time on the ground, which is unusual for lemur species. They like to eat fruit, leaves, flowers, bark, and even tree sap. In the early morning, our lemurs like to sun themselves until they're nice and warm. These lemurs have powerful scent glands and they use this odor as a communication tool. Lemurs mark their territory by scent which informs others not to enter their home. We have one more species of primate here at the Caldwell Zoo. Let's go find our black and white caldus. monkeys are the largest species of primate that we have here at the zoo. They have a pretty large exhibit that they share with bongos, yellow-backed dikers, and a couple species of birds. The zookeepers are getting ready to let them out for the first time today. Let's see what they do.
Wow, they sure do like their breakfast. Next, I'll take you to see where we make all of the animals' diets every day. This is our commissary, where we make diets for over 2,000 animals every single day. Now that's a lot of mouths to feed. This is our weekly grocery list. Every week we go through about 700 pounds of meat, 10 cases of fresh greens, 850 pounds of fruits and vegetables, 325 pounds of fish, 480 rats of mice, 4,500 crickets, 5,250 worms, and 18 dozen eggs. Many of our primate species eat similar diets consisting of fruits, vegetables, and some insects. Let's take a closer look at them. Just like we eat two meals a day, so do our primates here at the zoo. The diet in front of us belongs to the squirrel monkey. On the right is the diet they have in the morning, which is a blend of sweet potato and monkey biscuits. The diet on the left is their PM diet. This is what they get for dinner. This diet has apples, bread, egg, cabbage, oranges, and a couple more monkey biscuits. Our cotton top tamarins and golden lion tamarins get the same diet every day. Their diet consists of eggs, monkey biscuits, raisins, apple, banana, waxworms, crickets, and then some special marmoset diet to give them the rest of the nutrients that they need. Remember those two ring-tailed lemurs that we saw today? Well, these are their breakfast and dinner diets. On the right, we have their breakfast diet, which consists of monkey biscuits and spinach. On the left is their dinner diet, which consists of more monkey biscuits, apple, banana, sweet potato, carrot, and a few raisins. Another favorite food of our lemurs is the Madagascar hissing cockroach. We have them here at the zoo because we use them to teach all about decomposers in the rainforest. These little guys, or should I say big guys, are packed full of protein and our lemurs love to eat them. Remember when our colobus monkeys were swinging from branch to branch this morning for their breakfast? Well, this is what they were getting. Every morning, our eight colobus monkeys have some lettuce, spinach, cabbage, romaine, turnip, and kale. They also get some yummy peanuts hidden all around their exhibit. In the evening, our colobus monkeys have a mix of monkey biscuits, potato, apple, sweet potato, bread, orange, and banana. These guys sure do have a yummy diet. When we really want to make our primates happy, we give them some of these yummy, nutritious mealworms. We even have some super worms, which are much larger than the normal mealworms. Thank you so much for tuning in to learn about primates here at the Caldwell Zoo. Do you have questions? If so, you can email us at education at caldwellzoo.org or send a letter to the Caldwell Zoo Attention Education P.O. Box 4785 Tyler, Texas 75712